My name is Roy Anirban. I am the business operations manager here at Novi. Novi is a semiconductor company based in Delft. Our goal is to get rid of primary batteries by replacing them with energy harvesting to be able to power low power applications, for example, IoT devices or TV remote control electronic shelf labels. Our long term goal is to have a world where we do not have any primary polluting batteries uh, getting into the ocean or getting into the world that we know as a beautiful place to live in. My name is Gerrit de Wacht. I'm a senior validation engineer and application engineering manager. Noe's mission is to uh, contribute to a sustainable future. And we do that uh, mainly in the IoT business. Um, there's a huge number of batteries in, in all those devices and uh, we aim to reduce the number of batteries in the world. So our harvesting solution is we develop a PMIC, a power management IC, which is basically the interface between a harvester and uh, the battery where we uh, store the energy in. Our NOE solution uh, has great advances. Uh, it reduces the footprint. A lot of our competitors are, uh, need a lot of external components so that the footprint uh, becomes bigger. And we don't use any inductors, so that's also a great help. And they're usually bulky, expensive and not really desired in a design. So that is what we do different from our competitors. One of the test challenges that we have is that we need to know the environment, right? So we know our chip, but then you need to know the harvester, but also the battery. So specifically the battery, we, we have a, a lot of different uh, battery types. So we need to know the characteristics of each battery. But since the charging currents are so small, uh, it can take a long time to charge and discharge the battery. That's where Keatley contributes greatly. So uh, instead of using a battery, we record a model of the battery and subsequently we can uh, replay the model. So we can quickly jump from one battery to another or from an empty battery uh, uh, to a full battery. And that greatly helps in speeding up the development time, the evaluation, uh, examine how, how a battery performs. Keatley has, has great advances because it's, it's really accessible. It's, it's easy, easy to work with. It comes really, it's, it's, you're up and running quickly. It doesn't need a uh, steep learning curve and it comes with scripting. So the scripts can be run already. Uh, they're built in, that greatly helps. Yeah, it helps us to, uh, to go to market fast, but also to serve our customers better, right? One customer uses this battery, another customer uses that battery. So with this uh, piece of equipment, we are able to quickly address the, our customer questions. Together we do contribute to a sustainable future and it has great impact on the, on the world and on uh, reducing the uh, yeah, number of batteries and the environment. We do create a sustainable future together as uh, Noe and, and Keatley Tektronics um, by, by having this application and developing this kind of uh, uh, harvesting. Uh, would really greatly reduce the number of batteries in the world and, and it's having a great impact on the world. I think reliable partners are really important to be able to reach that. Now there are two parts to it. Of course, the first part is to be able to develop a solution which we know is really good. And the way to do that is to have the right kind of testing equipment which can help us to reach at that point. And Tektronix is a really good partner in that case because they make world-class solutions with respect to testing chipsets and testing solutions uh, that are going to help us to reach the mission that we have. We see ourselves in five years with a wide range of solutions for different markets and we currently have two products that we have developed and going forward we want to make solutions which are even more integrated for different use cases. Within five years time we see a whole product portfolio where we will be able to make a huge impact on the primary uh, batteries that are being used at this point.